Here we are at Matthew Knight Arena, thanks to my good friend, well, former friend Greg Byrne, the athletic director at Arizona, who called me out for Chillin' for Charity. Uh, I'm excited to do this, actually, for two reasons. One is uh, we have a great relationship with the Kayao Foundation. Sue Donahoe, the folks at the Kayao Foundation, we collaborated last year on a pink helmet, which created great awareness. We were able to generate over $200,000, so happy to be here doing this. And the second thing is I'm real happy to see Greg Byrne finally reach for his wallet and pull out $50 that he's going to donate to the Kayao Foundation in my name. In fact, we did we looked at the bylaws, and it says if it's under 70 degrees, he should have to double his donation. It just happens to be 69 degrees here in Eugene right now. So Greg, we expect you to give $100. The other part of my responsibility here before I get this uh, cold water dumped on my head is to call out three additional people to this challenge. And the way the challenge works is if I call out your name and you don't have this cold water dumped on your head by July 10th, we'll set July 10th as a date, you have to give $250 to the KEL Foundation. If you document having cold water dumped on your head before July 10th, I will make a $50 donation to the KEL Foundation in your name. So the lucky three individuals that I'm calling out are Jamie Pollard, Athletic Director at Iowa State University. Number two, my good friend from our Nike Asia 2014 tour, Rosh Bjork, Athletic Director at the University of Mississippi. And number three, one of the greatest duck fans in the country, Sports Center anchor Neil Everett. So the three of you, you are now in on the Chillin' for Charity Challenge. I'm ready whenever you guys are. One, two, three. Woo! Woo! Okay. Good breathe. Hey, come on. Woo! Good work. That was quick. Thank you. I think. There you go, Greg, that's $100. We want proof that you cut the check. Double the amount necessary. Oh. Well done, partner. Thank you, guys. You guys did get it. Yeah, enough filming there, I hope.